yourself. I was just coming by to see how you're doing. I'm guessing not so good. When you took me to see Ethan, I felt good for the first time in so long. Like I could start over. You can. But it all keeps coming back. All that anger and sadness. How could I be so stupid? I, I stayed with the guy who hit me just because he said he loved me. And then I got Ethan in trouble to protect the guy who actually did hit me. I'm a disaster. You know, I have a long history of blowing my life up and then being left to pick up the pieces and go on. And each time I found what worked is I try to figure out what went wrong and how it made me feel. I'm learning that in therapy. Kiefer hurt me, but I still thought he loved me. And I believed him every time he said he would never do it again. Sadly, a lot of women allow themselves to be abused in the name of love. I'm scared I'll never be able to trust another guy again. Do you think it could happen again with another boy? It seems like a lot of guys say they love you, that they'll take care of you, and then they turn around and disappoint you. Every guy my mom's been with has been a disappointment, including my dad. He says he loves me, and but I've seen him turn into a monster. Between my dad and Kiefer, I don't know how I can ever trust a guy as long as I live. Hey, how's it going, beautiful? Oh, Ethan, hi. I was just about to call you. I saw Christina earlier today. Okay, how is she? Trying very hard to understand what's happening to her. But she said something that really concerned me. She said she didn't know if she could trust another boy. Well, you know, give it time. I guess it's all still pretty fresh. I think it would help Christina if you would talk to her. I, well, I have. I've spoken to Christina, yeah. I, I'm asking you to be her friend, you know, give her some attention. But, but not so much that she'd, she'd get the wrong idea, believe me. I just think it might be nice if guy that Christina looked up to could give her some positive reinforcement. Well, I mean, I have, I've reached out to Christina a little bit already, you know, just to make sure there are no hard feelings. And uh, I see your point, though. You know, we wouldn't want Christina to go through the rest of her life thinking every guy is a potential abuser. 